I've had some requests on how to fold the paper bellows in the pneumatic power system. They're a little tricky to fold in that they crease opposite directions. So what we have here is the pattern that's uh, available free at jeplans.com. First, what we'll do is, after cutting it out of course, we're going to go through and we're going to score all the folds with a, a knife that's a little dull. We don't want to cut the paper, we just want to put a crease in there. Then we're going to go along all the zigzags and score those as well. So I'm going to go through, I'm going to score all of it. Okay, once you have all the scores in, we're going to now, whoop, we're going to now kind of accordion fold it and kind of work the folds both ways. We're going to use a surface that uh, has a little give to it but gives you support at the same time using a soft piece of pine. Once the score is in there, it's fairly easy to keep folding. I'm basically going to fold the whole thing once one way, fold it the other way, then work on folding the, uh, the joints. Alright, so I've worked the folds back and forth quite a few times now. So now we're going to try and start putting creases here, kind of reversing the sides. As you see, they start to crease in. So just going to do a crease and a crease. It's kind of, this part's kind of tricky, it just kind of happens. This is much about letting the folds happen as it is about making the folds. Pieces in. It's kind of almost, once you get it started, this isn't too bad to keep going. That, that first one is a little hard to get started. Just kind of keep tucking them in as you go. Kind of comes together. There we have one corner. So let's see if we can repeat that again in the next one. Just have to open it up a little. And get the first one started. Almost have to do that a little bit. First one I started, I'm just gonna start working them in. Make sure we keep it. As we do each corner, the folds reverse on the remaining piece, so that's why I worked it back and forth a few times. Give it a good squeeze there. Finish our fold on this side. Just kind of keep working it as you go. And this one I'll have to trim this off here. So once you have all the folds worked out, we'll, we'll put the joint together here. I'm going to bind it together with um, something that's a pliable glue, maybe uh, just some silicone caulk or something like that. Just kind of have it held together real tight when it's glued. 
it should come out pretty good. Some of the flaws to the bellow, the paper in itself gets weak after use, will suck in, you end up putting little supports on or something like that. Um, it's hard to get a good seal on the, on the corner joint like this. In the future I'm going to make a new bellow and the seam will go down right down the middle instead of a corner. That way you'll be able to butt it together and seal it much more easily. Also one of the things plan is then having a second piece of paper, having a second piece of paper that glues on here that uh, will double its strength basically so that it doesn't wear to a buckling state so quickly.